flame arresters for the deflagration to detonation transition. Phase 1. Ignition. Whenever a flammable gas or vapor is mixed with air, there is the potential for an explosion. Accidental ignition of the flammable mixture will initiate a flame which, when confined in a pipe or vessel, will accelerate through the unburned mixture, driving the flame front forwards. Phase 2. Deflagration. The rapid increase in the temperature and volume of the burning mixture, together with conditions that increase turbulence in the system, such as changes in size, roughness, or bends in the pipe, etc., results in a pressure wave that travels ahead of the flame. This phase is typically characterized by subsonic flame speeds of several hundred meters a second, with peak pressures in the range of 10 bar. The flame can accelerate from a slow to a fast deflagration. Phase 3. Unstable detonation. If the flame continues unchecked, and if there is a sufficient pipe length, then due to flame front instabilities, it will undergo a sudden and rapid transition from deflagration to detonation. This deflagration to detonation transition, often referred to as a DDT, is characterized by supersonic flame speeds in the range of 1600 to 3000 meters a second and a shockwave that is now coupled to the flame front and creating enormous peak pressures, often well in excess of 100 bar. Phase 4. Stable detonation. Following a DDT, an unstable detonation will degrade to a less severe stable detonation. However, due to the gas mixture and changes in the pipeline geometry, further unpredictable DDTs may occur, resulting in what is known as a galloping detonation. The location of the incredibly destructive forces of an unstable detonation cannot be predicted with any certainty. It follows, therefore, that the use of a stable detonation arrestor in isolation is not suitable, as it would not stop a detonation in the DDT phase. Accordingly, and in order to ensure maximum protection from worst-case scenario explosions, LMAC technology strongly recommends that one of its patent-protected unstable detonation arresters be fitted in all systems where a detonation could occur. These unstable detonation arresters also provide protection against stable detonations and deflagrations, thus providing the operator with ultimate protection and complete peace of mind.